do it. Hey, it's me, Elon, on the top left. What's up, everybody? Uh, I haven't seen you guys since two weeks ago. Um, so let's talk about the Street Fighter 6 update. We have the entire roster, right? All 18 characters are out. We've seen the, the reveal of Zangief, of Kami, and of Lily. We've seen developer matches for just about every character except for the new three. However, this past week, we got a developer match featuring Zangief and Marissa. And boy, oh boy, it's an interesting one. Um, we were all kind of worried about Zangief and how he would play, right? Because Zangief is a grappler, and in this new Street Fighter world where we have parries and we have um, drive impacts and we have rushes, uh, drive rush and all this other stuff, grabs seem to be the answer for all of them. So having a grappler is going to be terrifying. And as we've seen from this uh, developer match, he is scary. Scarier than usual, I'd say. Uh, it's going to be a challenge for sure. But let's take a look at this two-minute match that we got from the developers. Also, damn, Zangief looks good. So does Marissa. Everything looks so good in this game. Okay, so first we're starting off with that crazy drop kick, the armor break from Marissa. So that's uh, that's showcasing some of that uh, Marissa only stuff. There is the Zangief armor. Did you see how far the drive rush took him? It's wild. It goes so far. Marissa applying pressure here. The perfect parry from Zangief straight into the super pile driver. That's going to be something that's going to make a lot of people very salty. Drive Rush into Whiff Knee into EX Super Pile Driver. And did you see the damage? That's legit like 20%. And then Marissa with her own command grab. I'm not sure if that's a counter or if that's a command grab. But either way, a lot of people have been saying that it feels like this is like the first time Zangief has looked appealing. And the fact that, like, Marissa's a little bit taller than him. Also, what in the world is that? That wall bounces. Or, like, it wall crumples. And it feels like that could have been something else, too. But look at this pressure. Oh, the armor break from Marissa to fight out of the corner. That looks like a stance cancel. There is what looks like is uh, one of Zangief's target combos. And then that drop kick. That drop kick? looks so crazy and the fact that he like you can hear him slap his own bicep is awesome so he still has like that charging fierce oh and here's the level three good lord look at that that's half health <laughs> that wasn't even a ca i can't even imagine what the ca version of that's gonna be Ooh, that's the drive impact and then the EX, EX Lariat. We gotta get used to that. Oh, goes under. And here comes Marissa with her level 3. This is a CA. And I think this is the first time we've seen this on full display where she puts a heart on your face. And then the Siberian, whatever it's called. He's got that parry back. And it looks like it's going to be a lot better than it was in Street Fighter V, right? Because it looks like that caught a knee. Whereas in Street Fighter V... That parry only caught, like, extend, extending limbs. Uh, so it looks like that parry is going to catch most kicks, including knees. Because in Street Fighter V, you can't catch knees, right? Any punch or any, like, knee, any sweep doesn't catch them. This, however, it's looking like it's actually going to be useful. Uh, I'm still super curious to see, like, how do we activate EX Lariat, right? I'm, I'm curious to see it. I'm curious to see. I'm sure it's going to be very simple. Like, maybe they're going to give Lariat a... Um, either a command or it's something as simple as, like, three buttons plus a kick or something, right? Um, who knows? Who knows? Uh, I just want to play this game, man. It's with both of these games. It's with all of these games. I just want to play them, dude. I just want to play them. What the hell? Um, but as we know, uh, it looks like we're not going to get another beta until... The game comes out, which is oh so close, but oh so far away. It's about three months out. Um, wait, April, May, June, yeah. So three months out, uh, like the first week of June. Um, I'm hoping there's at least some sort of Street Fighter Six presence 
at tournaments, right? Like, uh, like I'm hoping they're going to have a, a presence at Evo Japan. I hope they're going to have a presence at uh, Combo Breaker. Um, but who knows? Who knows? I think I'm going to start streaming a little bit more often instead of just one day a week. I think what I'm going to start doing is I'm going to start streaming in the mornings, right? Because I have some uh, I have some free time in the mornings. So I, I think I'm going to start like doing like some hang streams or something like that. Um, I've done them a couple times and they have always been a blast, right? Just like even if it's just stuff where we're where we're looking uh, like looking at Twitter or looking at TikTok, YouTube, whatever, just like scout sc scrounging for news, right? Um, I just want to like, you know, show up a little bit more because it's getting to the point where like I'm enjoying this show and I'm enjoying doing this stuff, but I want to expand um, and we can't expand if we don't have more content. So we need to do more content.